Thank you, Yasser. Yes, I'm here with uh, Shakriar Mamediarov, who just finished his game against uh, Grishchuk. Shakriar, first of all, welcome back uh, to the show, to the Grand Chess Tour. How does it feel to be back? It's very nice to play uh, in the board. Uh, and then, of course, we all miss uh, to play chess. And finally, we start to play. Uh, okay, tournament starts is not very well. I mean, uh, maybe some uh, boring um, uh, draws. I mean, but uh, we will see, I think, in next games, next rounds so or interesting games. Do you feel like you need a little bit of time to readjust yourself to competitive over the board chess? Does it feel different than a year and a half ago? Of course, of course, it's absolutely different chess, different, uh, I don't know, yesterday, I think in uh, some moves, uh, 10, 15 minutes, uh, normally, I play these moves in one minute. <laughs> and now I am not absolutely sure about my moves. Uh, maybe I need some time uh, to to play some games, and after some games, I think everything will back. Absolutely. So let's uh, discuss a little bit today's game. Yeah. Um, it looked very interesting at the beginning. Take us through it. Okay, I, I, I try to play c4. C4. I normally, of course, I start to play d4, but uh, I analyze this position for black, mm -hmm. but uh, but um, he surprised me in opening, and uh, I tried to play something very solid. He surprised you with this uh, opening. I, I mean, I mean, yeah, with Sasha, okay. I mean, not easy play because he play normally all lines uh, every time he tried to play, and he change every time lines. Sometimes kings Indian. Yeah, yeah, sometimes, and I play c4, but this line, of course. Uh, I know it's solid position for white and it's everything is okay, but uh, after here take take, I think if I not uh, sorry after d6, I think if not c5 move, uh, he can play next c5 move or knight g4. Uh, okay, I, I, I will say really I don't understand very well this position and this was actually what Almira was yeah. mentioning that after the normal h3 move. Black usually has C5, this move C5. Yeah, I don't like because it's absolutely long game and strategical game is bishop G5, H6, bishop H. Positions like you can play sometimes G5, bishop B6. It's long game, and uh, I think it's better to play C5. And after C5, is everything looks like he need to change something and maybe. If uh, white need to play for win, it's c5 is not good move. But mm. if you want to play normal, uh, good chess, I mean c5 is absolutely normal move because after take, uh, take rook e1, uh, it's problem if, if after c5 he play knight g4. I can play a move uh, like bishop c4 is very interesting also. I don't know, ah, it's bad move, yeah. uh, but I miss some. No, uh, queen h4, I think, first. Uh, what did I miss? No, Queen H4 first. Ah, Queen H4. Yes. Oh, this is very nice. Yeah. He not play this move. Yeah, I, I think it's a nice G4 bad move because Bishop C, uh, Bishop C4, yeah? Yeah. But if Knight G4, Bishop C1 is in James, yes? I think Bishop C1, yeah? Yeah, yeah. absolutely. I think I Bishop C4 I want to play. I miss and you're that. not worried that you're going to lose a pawn? Yeah, because it's, like uh, yeah, it looks strategic. It's okay. Okay, I mean, uh, after he take, I play uh, Bishop C2. Uh, here, bishop c2, and last, uh, if take queen d1, maybe white is some chance, rook d1, uh, and f6, rook d6. It is like Nimsovich positions, and maybe it's, it's not easy to play with black and white advantage. But if take and queen d5, bishop c2, queen c5, and queen h5, of course, it's he was not afraid five, of the yes. checkmate. <laughs> yes, if it is a checkmate, because it's queen g6 is made, yeah, and he played just take and end game is I mean after queen h5 g6 yeah g6 giving you back the pawn yeah and it's a draw position I also miss I miss uh, bishop b6 move and also I miss bishop b6 move yeah very strong because yeah. if you take on c6 then yeah, just yeah, yeah, rook c6. I think he will if bishop d7 some passive position maybe like okay I can play long uh, Okay, I mean some f3, rook d1, still is not easy, but uh, he played bishop b6 and I absolutely understand today is not my day and I need to play draw. <laughs> the, definitely the practical approach to uh, the tournament situation, yeah. getting back into gear of competitive chess. What are your ambitions for uh, this uh, tournament and your comeback to chess? Okay, after 
well, I don't know, one half a year uh, to say something. Uh, I have big ambitions and uh, I want to win tournament. No, I just want to play chess. Uh, uh, we need to time to back in normal chess. Uh, of course, it's not easy tournaments. It's two Romanian chess grandmasters. Also, is very good. It's very. If you see yesterday, it's Giri Anish. He got losing position. Yeah, he thinks also. I mean, it's very strong tournaments and two, two good grandmasters from Romania is also is very good. I think it will be very nice, very interesting tournament. Uh, it will be more, I think, many surprise games also. Okay, we will see. Perfect. Thank you very much, uh, Shaq. And we're looking forward to your combative style of chess to yeah. come back and give us some uh, fire over the board. Guys, back to you in the studio.